What's up guys, welcome to the new Rockon vlog. As you see, I have in front of me a brand new KTM 1290 Super Duke and I want to test it. We always do some massive drifts and tricks with it, but never a normal street riding where we can see how it performs. We are in England, so we're gonna meet up with my friend, the queen of super bikes. She has a crazy collection of really powerful bikes and she will take me around some beautiful streets so we can test the Super Duke, so let's go. Guess where we are, Ruby? Finally, we meet you, queen of super bikes in England. Oh, thank you. We are in the English countryside, and I've got loads of nice twisties prepared for you. Really? And uh, sunshine in England? How is this possible? Very strange. Very strange. <laughs> okay. So I have my Super Duke uh, with me, brand new mm -hmm. Super Duke. So it loves twisties. And which one will you take for I've the ride? I decided on the H2 because it's got 268 at the wheel. Dang! So the best chances of beating you on the Super Duke car. Okay, let's gear up, let's have some fun. Renato, she live up to her name, the queen of super bikes, <laughs> properly, man. I was barely keeping up with you, Ruby. You're too kind, Rob. I know no. this route really well, so uh, it helps. So, yeah. Ruby, what do you say you try my Super Duke and uh, you tell me to. how you how you like it? Yes, I'd love to. I've only ridden uh, the previous gen okay. uh, Super Duke. Um, this has um, a little bit, a few more bits on it. Definitely. Um, so a bit that, more talk. And that's a sharper back. beast. So yeah. ready? Yes, I'm ready. Okay, let's go. Let's get on again. How was it, Ruby? So it sick. So aggressive. The seat position, the you feel the rear suspension eating all the bumps and everything. It's nice, and smooth ride, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. But torque is every year. At the torque really, beast, huh? Yeah, really enjoyed that. <laughs> it, it, it's um, special in its own way for sure. It's one of the fastest hyper like hyper makers I've ridden, honestly. And I've ridden the ZH2, I've ridden the S1000R, uh -huh. uh, I've ridden the. Z900, ZL, and I've ridden the Honda CB1000R, like all the Nakers, this is one of the fun. Yeah. Okay, that's Ridiculous. great to hear. <laughs> oh, so, it's the grinning in my helmet. Double thumbs up from Ruby? Yes! Double thumbs up. What a bike! I feel like the torque and the power of the Super Duke is so road friendly, more so than any average sport, sport bike on the road, because there's torque in every gear and throughout the whole rep range. Do you know that actually KTM did uh, hundreds of thousands test hours mm. and 80% of them were done under 3500 mm. RPM wow. because the V-Twin as you say is mm. the perfect road mm. engine yeah. and you can pull out in every gear out of every corner yes. easily right? Yeah um, yeah I did feel that approaching corners coming out of corners uh, and also the gearbox is so smooth with the auto blipper and the up shift, the quick shift. Yeah, yeah. It just makes the whole process so seamless and you get in there quickly. Okay. So it's mind blowing how it's actually really, really quick. It's a very quick bike. And you told me before you ridden the Gen 2, right? Yes. And if you compare this one to the Gen 2, where would be the <laughs> one point that it's a different for you? I think the, okay. the gearbox is smoother on this. Yeah, yeah. The upshift and the downshift, because the Gen 2 has the upshift and the downshift. But I would say it was a little bit clunkier. 
Okay. And yeah. for, for me, I rode also the Gen 2 before. Yeah. And now the Gen 3, what this bike has an updated, of course, the soft frame is completely different. The complete bike is different than the yeah. Gen 2. Uh, so it makes the body position way more. If you felt this also, the whole body position is more aggressive because you are more on the front. Are the bars a bit lower on this then? Yeah, the bars ah. are bent, the whole frame is uh, higher the and the foot pegs are also more uh, back, back and foot. higher so your whole body is more in an aggressive stance, you know? That's so interesting. Yeah, so you feel yeah. more like a f fighting with a beast on yeah, the road. Yeah, yeah. it yeah. certainly felt beastly and aggressive but very usable. It, it's a weird balance, it's an interesting balance between the savageness of the bike but the usability of it, the comfort of the just sitting like that is much mm -hmm. more comfortable than you know other super sports say. Yeah. Feature that also shocked me is the brakes. Mm. It's I would say a fork bending brakes. It's when you hit the front brake, yeah. it really stops you. You yeah. feel the power of the Brembo Stylema calipers mm. and the disc brakes. Mm. So this bike has is equipped with some premium brakes, I would say. Yeah. And also the Super Duke is equipped with a really nice electronic package. Mm. It has from rider aids to ride modes, from rain mode, race mode, street mode. Nice. And it has a lot of sensors. Mm. Uh, so it has a SMR and MTC controls. Mm. Mm. So it keeps you on the road safe. Yeah. And it has also cool things like super moto mode. So you mm. can also slide into the corner if you nice. can. So a lot of cool electronics mm. that helps you to be faster Mm. on the track also mm. and also on the road yeah yeah and keeping you safe at the same time rube 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 <laughs> rube thanks for showing me around of this beautiful countryside in england you're very welcome and this twist it was perfect for the beast and yeah. for your h2 yeah i had cool. a such a blast thank you for having me with you today i thoroughly enjoyed riding the super duke uh, and I thoroughly enjoyed riding with you as well because you're absolutely mental, you're skidding your rear all the time, you're wheeling, you're stopping. I didn't so, pay her to say that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's been a pleasure and I hope this is not your last time in the UK. Definitely. Okay. So I would love to come back because it was a short day. Yeah. But I'm going to be back mm -hmm. and drop some comments below guys. What should we do next time when we ride together with Ruby? Check that. That's it for this time guys. See you in the next one. Until then. Rock on!